Hi, and welcome to another tutorial uh, by the Teleport Me team. Uh, I'm Vinit Devaya. I'm the CEO and founder of Teleport Me, and I'm happy to introduce another new feature that has been built by our team. If you're new to our channel, uh, we are teleportme.com. We are the largest uh, virtual tour software product in, in, the, uh, in the world. And uh, we have millions of customers and, and tens and thousands of businesses that use our product uh, to create virtual tours. So I would recommend for you to go to teleportme.com, uh, go to our pricing, uh, see if this is something that, you know, kind of fits your budget. Is it something that would, uh, you know, help your business move forward? And if it does, either you can uh, get in contact with us here in the chat bubble, uh, send us an email at support at teleportme.com. We have our, e our phone number right here. Feel free to give us a call. Uh, try the product. You know, I think for, if you're looking for a virtual tour software, we're number one recommended by all the big experts in the field. And we've been doing this for about 10 years now. Uh, without any further ado, let me move on to the tutorial. So uh, today what I'm trying to introduce to you is a feature that we call as a navigation mode. Now, if you are familiar with our software or any other virtual tour software, what you can do is uh, you can add hotspots to navigate between panoramas. For example, uh, in this case, I am here and I want to navigate to the, so I take this hotspot right here. I'm going to change the icon. I'm going to probably make it this. I'm going to link a panorama. So I'm going to link it to this one. Now, once this panorama is set, then I can go to the panorama. Oh, there's another panorama right here. So I'm going to add a hotspot, change the icon. There you go. And then I link it to this panorama, right? And now from here, I'm just linking these panoramas really quickly so that it is really clear as to what the uh, feature is. And then I link here. I think this is the one. And then over here, change the icon. There you go. And I'm going to link the icon here to this. Now I have all of these uh, panoramas linked. And now if I save it and I preview this. It takes some time to render, and now here we have it. So now when you go from here to here, you can see that while the panoramas are opening, they're not necessarily in the right direction because when I'm moving back here, I should be facing the TV. And when I'm moving back here, I should be moving, I should be facing the bed. Right. Uh, so to fix that, what we have done is we have done a, we have added a couple of settings that you can use. Now, uh, I'm going to run you through these. So this is right now the panorama, as you can see, you have the TV right here. Now, specifically for this, what I go here, I go here, and I click on panorama. And what you can do for every panorama is set a direction that you think is right. Now, in this case, I'm picking this direction and I'm saving it. We're calling the north, right? So every panorama has a north. And what we're going to do is, I think this one is here. Save it. The idea is to just pick the direction that you know is the right direction, not necessarily the north itself. So now what we have done is we have aligned all these three panoramas in a specific direction. Once we do that, um, we can maybe go to the hotspot section. And now here, we can see that the view direction is not set. So that's very good because I'll, I'll show that to you in a, in a moment. Then we look at here. View direction not set. We go here. I don't think we have panoramas here. So let me just add some panoramas right here. 
uh, hotspots. I think they're both in this direction. go. I'm going to link this to here. I'm going to add another one right here. Select link. There you go. So I think I have linked it to these two panoramas right here. And the view direction is not set. The view direction is a functionality that lets you set up what is the view that your user or your customer is going to have when they click on this panorama. So for example, in this, this is what it's showing right now because this is the default. This has not been set, but this is what you're getting uh, from the uh, default. You know, it's just, there's nothing set, but this is what it's going to show you up. Like, so when I click, on this, for example, when I click on this panorama right here, let me refresh this. And so here, let me show you this now. Now here you have these two over here, which are these two. So over here, now if I click on this hotspot, you can say this is the view direction. And then this is the view direction. This means that when I click on these panoramas, it will open up in this view. Now, this view is not necessarily the right navigation view. This is actually probably wrong. So uh, just to demonstrate, I'll, I'll kind of save this here and I'll show it to you. So when I click on here, it takes me to this view. But this is not the right view because when I'm coming from that direction, it should ideally open up here somewhere like this. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the share settings. I'm going to share settings. And I'm going to select navigation mode automatic. When you select the navigation mode automatic, it will align all the panoramas automatically so that when you click on the hotspots, it will have kind of a navigational view rather than the initial view setting that we have. So I'm going to save this. Now here again, you remember when I clicked on this panorama over here, it opened up the um, the cupboard side of it, right? So it op when I clicked on this, you can see it opens up this. Now now that I've set navigational, and I'm going to refresh this one more time you will see that it will open up in the direction of how you would see it when you walk through it. So there you go. Now you see that it's now it's opening up in the direction that it would open up as you're navigating. So now if I move here, you will see now just to give again another example over here. Um, oh, right here. Sorry. Now in this panorama, you can see that this hotspot has a view direction, which is this way, which is which is wrong because you can see that the TV is behind us. So when I technically click on this hotspot, it should it should open up a view towards the bed. But now that I have selected navigation mode and I've set the north, when I click on this, it should open up the bed. So Let's try that now. You see, it is opening up in the direction of the bed. So it is kind of a walk, walk through navigation mode. Now, if I go back here, now again, let me show you here. Now, when I select this panorama, you'll see that this is the view direction, right? But now if I click here, you'll see that it is moving in the direction that you would have to navigate. So when I click here, it's navigating it properly. Now sometimes, so now this is the navigation mode and this feature is right here in the share screen. It shows navigation mode automatic or manual. Now if you pick manual, it will save, it will use all the 
uh, options that you add manually. It doesn't, uh, the navigation is the way you pick the initial position of the panorama or the initial view of the panorama and so on and so forth. Uh, now I'm gonna click automatic again. I'm gonna show you one small difference. Now, for example, let's say, uh, I think this is a good example here, right? So when I'm moving from here through this panorama, right? So let me go somewhere here. I hit this. I don't really like this view. What I want to do is when I hit that panorama, I want it to open up here. I want this view to open up. So what I can do is I can go here, I can select this and I can set the panorama view to be here like this. Save it, save this. And now again, do you remember when I went from the other one? So I'm gonna go back. And now it's going to open up in the direction that I want it to open, right? So now you see it's opened up in the direction that I want it to open. Now, that's pretty much it. I think if you look at, uh, if you see all the features, uh, again, just to reiterate, um, this is the navigation mode here that will select all the panoramas that once have been set to north. So the way you set a panorama to north is you go, you select the panorama here, you select the panorama from here, and then you align all of this in the right direction. So you go here, kind of approximate, this is the direction, save it. There's a save button, save option right here. Save it, don't forget to save it. Save it, this is saved. Now once this is done, then you just go to the share option, you pick navigation mode and you get it there. If you want to override the navigation mode for specific panoramas, all you have to do is select that hotspot, set the view direction to the view direction that you want. Now I want this to open up in this direction. And I save it, save it here, refresh this. So this is the direction it should open up in. There you go. As you can see, this is the direction that I've set and it is opening up in the same direction. So. The idea is that with these different controls, you can really, really optimize the navigation through the through the tour. And by setting the setting the north for your panoramas, you can get a very smooth navigation. Uh, we don't have to worry about it. So uh, again, to reiterate, the first thing you want to do when you set up your tour is set up the north for all your panoramas. It's really simple, like I showed you over here. You go to the panorama tab and then you just pick the panorama and then pick a, a direction. It doesn't necessarily have to be the north. It just has to be a direction that is consistent in all the panoramas. So if you have taken the photos and you know, okay, this is the direction that is consistent in all the panoramas. And then you make sure you align this white strip right here in approximately that direction and you save it. Over here, there's a save save option right here now once you have done the north setting then you you will set up the navigation automatically by selecting the navigation more automatic right here now if there are certain hotspot views that you are you don't like you feel like okay this can change i i don't like how the automatic is set all you have to do is select that hotspot so in this example let me show you if you select the hotspot, you will get the option to change the view direction. So hit change, you will see that this icon will pop up, move it around, find the direction you, lo you like, and hit save. And that's it. And now every time someone clicks on this panorama, they will see this hotspot will take them to this exact view. 
uh, I think this is pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us and uh, thank you.